Hi, welcome to the EECT 74 Ampound. The Ampound, as you can see here, is a very compact unit that is a two-in-one tester. On its first range of tests, you can actually quickly go through a complete fuse box, checking which fuse may be blown, may be in good condition, but have no current flow, and a fuse that's good, but has actually current flow through. The reason why we have this is that we, when we have a vehicle that has a drain on the battery constantly, we can now use the amp hound to very quickly locate which circuit via the fuse has an actual drain through the system. We can do this without even having to remove the fuses. So on its first test where we're checking our fuses, you can see we get two probes and we've got our mini fuses on the fuse box. And we can go on this and go across the blades and actually check. So for instance, if I had a blown fuse, I'd go across and if we looked at the, the display, it would come up with three dashes to indicate a blown fuse. If we then put it onto the contact points on top of the fuse, if we get a constant beep with a zero value, this is inst indicating a good fuse, but there's no current flow through it, which is what we expect with everything switched off. Okay, now we're gonna use the amp hound in its second mode of testing, which is actually giving us a value of the current flowing through the circuit. To do this, the first thing we do is actually select the, the fuse type and the value of the fuse that we're checking. So on the two buttons that we've got on the right hand side of the display, we can select the fuse type, and you can see that on the, the left we've got a dash which is now mini at the moment. We can go to standard, we can go to maxi. So we select mini and then we select our range from 5 through to 30 amps. So we get our 15 amp value. And then press and hold and that sets it up with the three dashes. Now we go across to our fuses and we can check across to see which ones have got power. You notice we've got the three little beeps and then it indicates currently at the moment that this fuse and the circuit on it is drawing 2.6 amps. And we've done that virtually in seconds rather than having to remove the fuse. If this was a fault on the car, now we'd have to remove that fuse, check the circuitry to find out what's drawing that because that would drain a battery within a couple of hours. Hope you've enjoyed this sort of short video on the amp hound and sort of, I know we look forward to seeing you soon on other videos. Thank you.